Hey, Dr. Shook here. In this video, what I want to talk about are your is your ability to show up as actually having antibodies to your thyroid. A lot of people don't realize this, but with autoimmune conditions, you have to be healthy enough or fit enough to actually make antibodies or enough antibodies that they will show positive if you get your blood drawn or on a blood test. So, so a lot of patients that are autoimmune, what you have to do is you have to look at their total white blood cell count and see if it is low. If it is low, that can be an indication that they, they don't have enough capacity to make enough antibodies to actually show positive on a test. Now when you go through LabCorp or any of the the commercial labs, when they look at your, your, your thyroid antibodies, what they're actually looking at are the Ig uh, IgA antibodies. Whenever we go through Cyrex labs and we, we get testing for autoimmunity through them, they look at IgA and IgG combined. So you get more antibodies combined, so you get you'll get a greater quantity and you'll be able it's a more sensitive test is what it is is what it comes down to. But it's a really important point to know that if your immune system is suppressed, not only you're not going to have enough white blood cells, but you're also not going to have enough of your T and B cells. They're going to be lower. And the B cells are what make antibodies, and those antibodies what what the antibodies are is they're tags. It's kind of like walking up to something, sticking a sticky note on it, and by tagging it and saying, writing on there, you know, kill this if you see this in the future. That's how your immune system becomes immune or develops immunity. So if your total white blood cells are suppressed, your T and B cells are both suppressed, you may not have the capacity to produce antibodies. If this is the case, then you may show as false negative on your lab testing. I'm Dr. Shook. Just wanted to let you know that I appreciate you taking time for to visit us and learn more about your health. If you have any questions or anything, let us know. Uh, we'd love to hear from you.